I'm Colin Robertson, President of the Storica Foundation of Canada, and I've spent my career serving Canada abroad. And that's why I'm delighted today to be supporting Meg Wilcox to be the next Prime Minister of Canada. Meg Wilcox should be the next Prime Minister of Canada because she's proven that she cares about Canada. She's shown her commitment to the process throughout her life, and she's got a platform that's right for Canada. Leadership. As a girl guide, as editor of Heritage Press, as an active participant in model parliaments, including in opposition and doing a stint as Prime Minister, she has consistently shown that she cares and understands how the process can work. Commitment. As an artist in new media, as a debater at university, as a volunteer with Historic Affairs, as a graduate from French immersion, uh, elle est parfaitement bilingue, as a page in the House of Commons, and now as editor coordinator FYI Canada, the intelligent Facebook for Canadian youth, Meg Wilcox has consistently shown she cares about the community in which she lives and works. And what would Meg do as Prime Minister? First, she'd persuade each province to ensure every high school graduate has taken a course in Canadian history and civics so they can better appreciate our wonderful country. Second, she'd work with service clubs, like Rotary, make herself participated in a program that took her to Thailand, to increase youth exchange programs, programs like Forum for Young Canadians, like Encounters with Canada, like Katimovic, again, so that more young Canadians can meet one another, talk about where they came from, and so better appreciate the diversity of this wonderful country. Finally, Meg would give real meaning to civic responsibility by setting the voting age at 16 so that more young Canadians would be able to meaningfully participate in the democratic process. Speaking of engaging youth in the democratic process, she has already created, for her challenge, a video petition with youth from across Canada that will be tabled in the House of Commons in February. And that's why I'm proud to support Meg Wilcox as Canada's next Prime Minister. Perfect.